Hi there everybody, this is Mac the Best, and welcome back to another episode of Millionaire City. So I've been saving up the money. Um let's just put the music on. So I've been saving up some money and I'm going to build some stuff down on that new expansion. Um No collections today, just building, so it's probably gonna be a relatively quick part. Uh anyhow, it's going to be like this, I don't care. Right, so what are we going to build? Well, one thing that you do know that I'm going to build is, of course, the hospital. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and do that first. Uh, 10 million it costs. Uh, looks pretty cool, actually. Uh, I'm capturing, it's going to capture that skyscraper up there, it's going to capture all these apartment blocks. Um, damn. <laughs> Uh, right, I think I'll get rid of that one. Uh, it's only generating one plus one, so... Right, so the hospital captures all of this. It'll also capture whatever I build in this expansion here. Um, it's also going to capture what I'm going to build down the bottom here. What am I going to build? Well, I'm going to build something a little bit different. Um, it's going to be three of the same building. It's going to be a Parisian townhouse. Now, this is, it looks a little bit like a loft block, uh, but apart from the price, it is exactly the same as a skyscraper. So, same XP, same income as a standard skyscraper. Uh, the only difference is, uh, well, it costs 4 million more. But, I don't care because they look kind of cool. Um, they're going to be quite heavily upgraded here as well, so not bad. And they have 35 tenants, which is also the same as a skyscraper, which is going to boost this hospital income by quite some way. Um, so that should be cool. So three Parisian townhouses down there. Um, there could be a fourth down the bottom here if I expand out this way. Uh, not entirely sure yet, uh, just out of curiosity. Right, the next expansion is 72 million, which is quite a lot. I'm going to be building what I'm going to build in here first um, before I think about expanding. And when I do expand, um, I'm not entirely sure which way I'm going to expand yet. We've got all of these we can go for, so I'm not entirely sure. I might go for this one because we can boost up the income from the hospital, but at the same time there's this large piece of river here, so we're not going to be able to build that much. Still, think it might be worth it. Um, I mean, the price of uh, all expansions stays the same, so it really doesn't matter to be honest. Yeah, it'll probably be this expansion next, um, but that'll be for another time. Uh, these House of Harmonies, uh, they're pretty good. Um, they're more or less on par with an apartment block luxury. I've currently got some hostesses in there. Uh, slightly less boost on this house, uh, but it does have 111 income with the apartment block luxury at 133, so it's not too bad really. It's pretty much an apartment block luxury. Uh, one big difference though is you have 28 tenants in the apartment block luxury, whilst you only have 6 tenants in the house of harmony. So if you're placing um, buildings around commerces, you're going to want to build apartment block luxuries instead of House of Harmonies, really. Uh, these eco homes are uh, pretty decent as well. Um, this villa is at 160%, currently generating 187,000. This eco home at 150%, currently doing 182,000. So, not really a big difference when it comes to that. I think they're actually exactly the same if you upgraded them to the same amount. Um, same amount of tenants as well, same XP generation. Um, if you're putting short contracts in, however, the villa is definitely the better one because it does generate a little bit more income for short contracts. With large contracts though, it um, doesn't really matter. Uh, if anything, the eco home will be better because it is a whopping 800,000 cheaper, so could be worthwhile if you're going for early early high income uh, standard contract for a hostess and eco home is 72,000 so that's not bad uh, and it costs 800 grand less than a villa so could be worth it really 
Um, apart from that, that's pretty much it. Uh, so next time you'll probably find out what I'm going to build here. Um, I'm not sure whether to do a little progress check. Um, sort of a video progress check where I basically wait for all of the contracts to be ready to collect. I collect them all and we see how much we make. Um, I'm just wondering whether to do one of those just for fun. Um, just because I want to really. Um, let's go ahead and visit a couple of cities, upgrade some houses, just to make up a little bit of time. Um, just to make more of a bulk of a video, really, like the five grand bonus, of course. Uh, one thing I must show is this city here. This is absolutely brilliant. This is kind of my des sort of design. So this person is completely mad on three-story luxury. I'm guessing they might replace these townhouses eventually. Uh, I think that's starting to happen over here. A uh, very nice city here. And we also have a boost from this city here. Um, I'm seeing the company value of this city going up. That's a sushi bar, by the way. That's quite something I haven't built yet. That's a Vegas bar as well. I haven't built one of those. Nice variety of commerce here. I'm kind of guessing that all of these are going to be spruces at one point. Uh, there's the giant snow globe in there as well. That's a very that city's coming on nicely. I've seen the company value of that going up in recent days. Right, so that's going to be it. Um, so thanks ever so much for watching this part of Millionaire City. I'm Matt the Best, and I will see you next time for more.